Do you want to streamline your site's navigation for free? Well, look no further as in today's video we are exploring toggle menu widget by W Design Kit. This handy tool lets you hide or show extended content with just a simple click, enhancing user experience with sleek collapsible menus. So without any further ado, let's dive in and check this widget out to make your site more user friendly in no time. The widget we will be using here is offered by W Design Kit. Speaking in terms of figures, it includes over 2000 pre-designed templates and 100 plus pre-built widgets for Elementor, Gutenberg and Bricks, along with a cloud workspace and much more. We will discuss about more of its features in detail soon, so make sure you watch this video till the very end. Now let's start with the tutorial. Make sure you have installed Elementor. And we will also need W Design Kit, so come up here and click Add New Plugin. Then search for it. And here it is, W Design Kit. Simply click on Install Now. Then Activate. Moving ahead to Appearance. And here as you can notice, I am using Next Theme. However, feel free to use any other theme as per your preference. Now in order to use this plugin, we will need to make an account with W Design Kit. Simply come here and click on W Design Kit. Next, up here in the header section, click on Login. At the bottom here, it's written don't have an account. Click Sign Up. Now this web page will open up where it's visible that you can sign up with your socials or here after you fill all the details mentioned, simply click on this button. I already have an account so I'll simply click Sign In. And then I will click on Continue with Google. Once you're logged in, you will get to see this kind of interface. It's time to activate our widget so come up here in the header section and click on browse widgets. Now search toggle. And here it is, toggle menu widget. Simply download it by clicking on this icon. Now let's make sure it's downloaded by going into the my widget section. Perfect. Now opening the Elementor editor, here's my page where I have already imported the widget. If you want to do the same, simply come here in the widgets panel and search toggle menu. Then drag and drop it inside the workspace. For now, let's just select the widget from the navigator and under the content tab in here, you will get to see the customization options. Let's go through all of these one by one. Opening the first options drop down menu, you can see it's pretty easy to understand. From here, you can choose the direction of the menu's opening. Like if your menu lies at the bottom of the page, you can make it open on the upside by clicking on top. Also, we have this button text option. Using it, the text written on the button can be changed. We will keep all of these settings as it is and move to our next main customization option which is pop-up. Opening its drop down menu, you will get to see navigation and social sub options using which we are gonna add our menu items. Like for example, assume this is your own portfolio website. So you might want to add a home, a portfolio and an about me section within this menu to help navigate your potential clients to those web pages easily. To add them, simply come here and click on this item box. Then name it home. Down here in the link input field, you also have to add a link to that page. I'm leaving it as it is but don't you forget to add one so that in order for these menu items to work. Next, we want to add two more navigation menu items that are portfolio and about me. So click on add item and do the same process again. Now we know that being in any profession, it's very important to link your socials. That's why our team has added this dedicated social option here. Simply choose its layout by opening this drop down menu. We've got two options here that are horizontal and vertical. I'll keep it vertical only. Moving ahead on opening the item boxes, you will get to see three options that are type, title and link. Title and link have the same use cases that we saw earlier in the navigation option but this type is new here. Using it you can basically choose whether you want them to be text or icon. If you choose icon, you will get the option to upload a social icon or in case you don't have it, Elementor's extensive icon library is also accessible in just a single click. Let's now revert to the previous option that was text and quickly add many social items. Cool. Down here at the end we have another option called extra button. Turning on its toggle button will add a big button at the bottom of the collapsible menu. Let's check it out. 
Next, I would like to rename it to book photo shoot. Nice. As usual, add a link to direct your visitor to that specific page. Lastly, through this alignment option, you can decide whether you want to keep this menu button on the left, right or center. Super flexible as it can be. Saying that, it's done. A quick run through of all the widget options. Our amazing looking menu is now ready to go online with our WordPress site. Let's update and have our final look. Now, don't forget to explore other amazing features W Design Kit offers. It provides various design assets and resources to create amazing WordPress websites in a matter of minutes. With its 2000 plus page templates, sections and kits, you can import pre-made WordPress websites. It comes with its own power widget builder using which you can convert any custom code to element or widget blocks or bricks elements and not only that as we shared earlier it has its own 100 plus growing collection of pre-made widgets for elementor gutenberg and bricks using w design kit page builder converter you can convert your elementor widget to gutenberg blocks and even bricks elements amazing right lastly for all the power wordpress users who create multiple websites w design kit also comes with its cloud workspace where you can store your created widgets and page sections on the cloud and import on any other website as well as collaborate with your team members. To be honest, you can say me delusional but W Design Kit is the tool which can increase your productivity by 100%. It comes with both free and pro plan. You can check all the details from this pricing page and choose the plan which suits your need. Hope you enjoyed the video. Now if you're curious, be sure to check out our next video where I will show you how to display image slideshows on your WordPress site in a more appealing way. Say goodbye to old traditional boring styles. Also drop a like and subscribe to the channel with the bell icon turned on so that you don't miss any of such amazing and creative videos we keep on adding inside our w design kit playlist every week until next time stay creative and keep learning